College and Jim Christian as they get James Carnick ready to play as he has finally gotten his waiver approved. Lewis, Lewis Johnson, Johnson and Colin, Colin Castleton. Castleton. Inside, Inside and they go, and they go possession, possession arrow arrow steady. Steady. He averaged a little over a dozen points a game last year. And will help him on the glass. Yeah, there's a turnover and going the other way is Winston Tabs. And heat trap. He plays high school basketball for Rack for a second. And you think about what he adds, even if just a screener, he adds wearing down your opponent. How important that is to have a screener, an, oc an occupier on the block, someone to make other bigs work. And they really don't have that at that at this point. Inside, and that one rattles out for Makai Ashton Lankford. Boston College a fight two in the early going, and here is Mann. High off the glass that time. I can't even imagine how frustrated <laughs> he's been to see. And they were deep. They shot the ball well, but Florida just able to pull it out. And that's really all you want to do in that first game is just find a way to get the win and hopefully build upon it in game two. With that nice move. Yeah, it's a great move, but defensively, you're backing up on your heels. Skip ball. Meet him higher. He gets it outside to Felder. And that rolls around, and it's pulled down by Noah Locke. Here's man now. He gets fouled and one. That is a nice bucket. Maintain the body control, and the sophomore will go to the line. Uh, this kid offensively just has so many skills. He's put, look, put on about 15 pounds of muscle, one or two inches in height. I would say three if it was. And the win against Army also with four assists. That one and particularly if it fits yes. in terms of his the way he was coached if it fits what you want to do Jay Heath. And now Kelly Backing up the defender always seems to follow the basketball and that guy gets open It's just so hard to maintain principles good hands there And inside mm -hmm. not far for BC is come in giving him Solid minutes make good decisions helped out offensively a bit. He's aggressive. I mean, it's it's that I mean, he's really seeking out shot opportunities He can knock down shots, but he's aggressive going to the basket, which makes him less one-dimensional Lewis to man feed in three miles apart and at five Eastern Kentucky against Georgia Tech game to game and you can already see it and I said yesterday I think they played yesterday. Jeez, it all bleeds together Yesterday, it's almost like the more responsibility you give a kid like that because he's out lawn a little bit. That's look, there are times. Bubble go over to <laughs> Ruko. Seven tabs jumper. That's no good. One and done. Johnson the board. And here come the Gators. Johnson full head of steam. And he, in that case, you're able to funnel him to one side or the other, but not give him a lane to the basket. Johnson almost lost the handle. Mitchell goes to help. Deruji. Shot clock's at 10. Lewis collects. Fatal for C.J. Felder. And that was made from the penetration by Jay Heath. But Heath plays so low. Uh, most guys get low and they lose balance. Heath gets low. And he Tabs is coming off that knee injury, missed about 21 months. And now Felder puts it on the floor and gets fouled from Noah Locke. And now it's Heat hesitation. Look how low he gets. It's hard to defend. And yeah, he does. He's just shooting with confidence. He's seeking it out with confidence. And usually they kind of go hand in hand. Man inside spinning, right? I mean, it's just one of those things where you gotta play well. Now. You know, if you have blue and orange in your hair, which is cool. It's your team. 
Let me just say what I need to be effective. Good for him for doing it. He traveled. They got him in the media guy. Six three in high school. Oh my! Yeah, look, you stood by me. <laughs> now I did break three vertebrae in my back, so I'm sure. It's... We've all been through a lot. Here's Heath now. Feeds inside Kelly. Kelly dribbling and couldn't quite the floor. Man handling. Lost it momentarily, and then to give off Lewis. Who stays in the game? Steps back, high arcing shot, and one. And I've said this before: if you're a right-handed shooter, you want to go to your left and hit a step back because you're already squared up in your shooting pocket. So many people think if you're right-handed, you want to shoot a step back. You go. 17-point advantage now. Man to the corner. Johnson wide open. John Chomby, John Crispin. Johnson gets back for the Gators. Man being harassed by Heath. He's at Stefan Mitchell. With Castleton rushing out on him, trying to answer his life. There. And it, it, there are a couple things about it. Yes, I have my own parking spot in the lane. Um, Look, we're going to be on defense first. Let's have one really good defensive possession and see if we can capitalize, but no. Making yourselves vulnerable, but you do want to be disruptive at some point here soon in the second half. Because that's too easy. The lob is there. If there's no pressure on the ball, it's an easy toss-up. Well, principle, easiest thing to forget. Felder gets it inside, has it rejected. And that one missed. Felder along the baseline, Castleton blocks it. And then the Castleton's a good kid, shoots it well, spaces it well, and is actually more physical than you realize, particularly the time he spent in the Big Ten. Too easy. The man gets inside and then just hits the brakes and puts it up and in. 17 down for Trey. Sample. Lewis puts that one up. That'll tab inside. Had it blocked. Keontae Johnson the other way. Johnson, good hands. That slowly dissed no, you. No, I don't think they can. Look, they had the personnel with Kerry Blackshear and obviously Andrew Nemhart. Kelly inside off the glass. That wouldn't go. Loose ball. Lewis. And there's just something you just see him come. Here it comes Scotty Lewis, and he knows Applebee's the guy that'll throw. Scotty Lewis has great length, so you could play a smaller lineup like this and have multiple playmakers. Carnick. It's just another one of those guys. How do you fit in the rotation? That's travel. I also would say, anecdotally, I don't feel like they call it very much. Not enough. Well, the NBA doesn't help that. You know, now kids are being taught how to do the, what I refer to as the double step back. The James Harden step back. And every time I watch it, I'm like, look, guys, we don't have the gather rule in college basketball. It's a travel. Right. And quite frankly, I don't care what you call it in the NBA. It's still a travel, man. Away to the corner, tabs three won't go. Johnson the board, a steal there. <laughs> he just wanted to do, like no, but what I'm saying like you have to be really good to get that angry to get tossed. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like you you can't be the third or fourth best scorer on the team yeah. and get tossed. And Winston taps. And under nine to go, the lead is 26 for the Gators. And a two-man show, Keontae Johnson. Well, because they can't use their athleticism the way they did at the level that they played prior. 
Johnson, jumper, got it. A real set routine for teams this year. This is just a bit of strange routine, so you always wonder how that plays into it. And goes to work into Castleton. On Mitchell, left hand. Little... In the game, and manipulating the game doesn't sound good, but we're all human, so it happens. There were fouls on plays there, there weren't. I go back to something I said before, too, and I think these officials are not given enough credit. Absolutely. Uh, KB is going to be sticking around. Can you imagine how tired of me they'll be? <laughs> like, I... Got a really good women's basketball game tomorrow as the Paul and Louisville will get together because one of the things that Danny Hurley liked to do during their time in the American Conference is they put a picture Jet X, Y, hipsters, the what else is there? Millennials. Like even within the last decade, I think you still